I believe that the diagnosis process, in my case for Alzheimer's, is very brutal. You see a GP, your GP sits you down and says to you, I'm sorry, I have to tell you you have Alzheimer's. Um, do you all say, what can we do, what can you do, what can we do to, for this? And he will say nothing, which is true. Medically, he can do nothing for you. But if there was a volunteer who had experience of the condition, waiting in another room somewhere, and the GP could say, well, we can't do anything medically, but we have an expert here who you can talk to about the condition. He could then give you to the person. They could then outline all of the possibilities, what you can do, lifestyle choices, uh, and things like that, and maybe help you to leave the diagnosis with some hope. And at the same time, the GP would then be freed up to see the next patient.